What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to another video. In this video I want to show you the reaction between Al plus CuSO4. Al is aluminum or aluminium and CuSO4 is copper to sulfate. The reaction, the product is going to be Cu plus AlSO4. The charge for SO4 is 2 or negative 2, it's charge for Al or aluminium is going to be positive 3. So we're going to rate it as 3 in here, 2 in here. So 3 is going to sit here, 2 for sulfate is going to sit here. Now we can call it copper and this one is going to be aluminium sulfate or aluminium sulfate. Let's see how to balance this reaction. First of all, I'm going to start with aluminium. In the product side, we have two atoms and in the reactant side, we have one. So I'm going to put two in here to make it balance. Copper, we have one in here, one in here. So it looks like it's balanced already. Let's look at the sulfur. Sulfur, we have three atoms in here and here we have one. So let's put three in here. So sulfur is balanced, so 3 in here, 3 in here, and oxygen also, we have 12, 4 times 3, 12, and here we have 3 times 4, it's going to be 12 as well, so oxygen is also balanced, but if you look again into the copper, we have 3 in the reactant side and 1 in the product side, so we need to have 3 as well in here, so now all of them are balanced, so it means that per 2 moles of aluminium we need 3 moles of copper to sulfate in order to produce 3 moles of copper and 1 mole of aluminium sulfate. So that's how we balance this reaction, and this reaction since we have Al plus copper sulfate, we're going to call it single displacement reaction. Any type of reaction that we have C plus AB and gives you AC plus B is called single displacement reaction. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave me a comment if you have any question. Thank you for watching and have a good day.